how comfortable you are with what you know is more significant than what you know. The greatest people in the world, whatever they have crafted themselves to be the most fantastic ad, do not show off. In fact, they have become really humble with what they have mastered. The moment you want to show off to the world what you know, what happens is that you operate from a scarcity. Anyway, tell me, why do you want to show off? Why? Because there's a lack. So, show off means lack. It means there's a void. The void needs to be filled. And this urge of filling the void will cause you to appear to be greater and better than who you actually are. And this is what we keep seeing all around us. Those people who are not comfortable with who they are and what they know, they go on trying to impress the world as if the whole world is full, which is so wrong, isn't it? If the sense of equipoise is within you with what you have become great at, then what you have known is the blessing to the world. Otherwise, it is uproar outlandish and rather at times disparaging to the world because of the superiority that one tries to impose on others because of what the person has acquired. If you are just at ease with yourself, with what you have evolved to become, you will see that you have become a more humble person. You have become more refined human being. And that's what is seen in the world today. So as long as the knowledge is just there to show off, it is just some level of a spectacle, display of something. But when it comes to inspiring the world to do something better in life, that's when the sense of ease, the sense of equipoise with what you have learned, and that knowledge becomes the bliss to the world. And that's what we're here for. So it is not about what you know and how much you know. It is all about how comfortable, how comfortable you have become with what you know. Step by step.